round two for me, round one for them. It's uh, early in the morning, We've missed a lot, lots been going on, not really. Nobody's awake. Nobody's awake. We're heading to Chicago is the moral of the story, so we'll see you there. And that's the intro. Stop and do a little pee, and it's like the third time I've had to go. Got the bladder of an infant. What? What? We've reached our first destination. Now, highlight of the whole trip, probably. The world's largest truck stop. Oh, yeah. It's a little different than the last time I was here. Much more open. They've changed it since I was here last. Yeah, it's a lot more open. We decided to ditch the rental car. Go ahead. Take the truck on the rest of the way. Chicago. Chicago. Just got done oh, eating at the world's largest truck stop. Had the world's largest meal. Filled I had up. Garbage. Filled <laughs> up with the world's largest gas. I was disappointed. He's disappointed in his Dairy Queen. So hopefully next stop Chicago after probably about five bathroom breaks. This is absolutely ridiculous. We've been in freaking road construction for like 20, 30 miles. It really sucks when you're going 80, I mean 70 miles an hour on the interstate and now all of a sudden you're going 45. We did for the last hour and a half or something. Uh, We're making good time too. Uh, we'll see you. Ridiculous. Illinois Transportation Department of Transportation. Boo. Boo. Ought to be a law. 10 miles maximum. And then you gotta let people go. I'm headed for Bright Lights, Big City. Chicago. Well. That was an adventure. We got a hold of the, uh, the place we're staying is a kind of a weird place. It's kind of like a B&B, &B, where you have to meet somebody out front. It's not a hotel. I'll explain later. <laughs> but trying to figure out how to get into this parking ramp was a pain in the ass. Because there's like two levels of the street. We kept going around the circles because Siri kept telling us to go around the circles. We kept being on the bottom. We finally just said, screw it. We went like eight blocks down the road. Yeah, got on the right road. We're here now. Now we're going to get into our building. All right, so we're in our apartment is what it actually is. Kind of weird. I was actually looking for hotels and I didn't filter my search results and apartments popped up. But this was like the same amount as a freaking hotel. So I said, screw it, and started looking at it. And it's a freaking whole two bedroom apartment in freaking downtown Chicago. This is the other bedroom. Another bathroom right there. Where big boy just got done peeing. Let's see if you get a good view of this. I don't know what it is. We're gonna check out what our roof looks like. We have access to this. That's actually not that's fine. It is a little hot. Isn't this freaking radical if we were in the 80s? Get a little fire pit action going. Just sit out here and hang out. Yep. Just living life in the big city. There's a freaking TV up, up on this mother. Can't see it right now because it's sunny, but I bet it's pretty cool in the rain. <laughs> Pretty badass. I like this. Yeah. Okay, let's go check out the lounge gym area. Don't leave in the morning. My world. 
be moving fast. And this is the gym. And here is the pool. So that's the gym floor. So obviously we won't come back to this one. I'm headed for Bright Lights, Big City, Chicago. I'm headed for Bright Lights, Big City. Here we are walking down Magnificent Mile, Michigan Avenue. Yeah, this is the Trump Tower. First stop is the Bean. These guys aren't used to the big city life, so, you know, since I'm a regular Chicagoan, I thought I'd show them around. Where does that go? I Made mean, it to the top of the Willis Tower. Apparently Sundays are busy. Boom. <laughs> Navy Pier. Centennial Pier. What are we gonna drink? That is actually low key cool. It's a lot of low key. Look at all this. What? Look at all this vegetation. Vegetation, like palm tree with her. A palm tree area. Palm tree oh, area. Oh. It was a deep dish. I am full. I'm stuffed. I'm full. So we walked by this uh, dog park right outside of Navy Pier. And we keep walking by people with dog, <laughs> little dogs going to the dog park. Kind of neat. Middle of the night. Well, not middle of the night. It's like nine hours night, but still. That's gonna do it for day one. Adults are gonna relax a little bit now, you know what I'm saying?